What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. Alrighty guys, so let's get into this market talk, man. Um, as you guys do know, we did get these packs yesterday with Pedro Sajagovic, Tony Parker, Big Z, and all that good stuff. So let's look at the market. Let's see what's going on. Let's check out Tony Parker's price, Big Z's price, and all that good stuff. So to be honest, that set yesterday was kind of a total bust, not going to lie. Um, Pedge is honestly not a bad card. Even though he does only have like 15 badges, it's definitely going to be better. But uh, yeah, Tony Parker is definitely going to drop in value. Even though, in my opinion, he's a very good card. I already got big, I already got every single card auctionable done. So uh, that is why my MT is back at 400k. But uh, yo, if you guys want, you should probably try sniping out this filter. People are gonna need these cards, and honestly, when these packs are out of out of when these cards are out of packs, they're definitely gonna rise up in value. Right now, I don't think it's a good time to pick up though. I think they do drop a little bit more on Friday. Right now is most definitely not a good time to put, pick them up unless you do want to do the solos. But here's the problem with XP, guys. You have to lose MT. Like it's hard to make MT if you're going for XP. Because you're going to lose money off the reductions, especially off this Pedis to Djokovic, um, who is going for around 200k still, and this card is not good. Like, if you're just trying to pick him up to use him, he's just a shooter. Other than that, he's nothing special. He literally could just shoot. Um, but, oh, let's get into some more talk. Um, looking at the market, looking at a bunch of investments that you guys might have. We got Mono Ginobili, uh, the Dominique Wilkins. Well... Manu Ginobili is still a pretty damn good value right now. Not gonna lie whatsoever. Um, but if you guys do have him, you should probably sell him. I kind of want to sell him off. I think he might drop again Friday. So, to be honest, man, we're gonna get idols Friday. Most definitely gonna get idols Friday. So, what's gonna happen is his price is either gonna drop big time or it's gonna go up big time. I think it's gonna go up, but I not totally sure like i'm kind of nervous oh Jokic is definitely a player i could sell right now so also another tip man let's check out Jokic's price because he is in the challenges so uh let's check out how much Jokic is i know i have a couple of my collection i have two of my auctions so uh let's see what ruby Jokic. okay ruby Jokic is going for 2900 he was going for like 1100 so now here's another mt method if you guys want if you guys want um I noticed a little something when i pull packs i kind of keep all these players here just in case they do they do get like a little challenge like that is a very good idea that's why i usually have my collection stacked out because if they do end up getting a challenge so for instance Jokic got a challenge today and what was the other one we got devin booker so i think i have a devin booker in here if not i have one in my collection so another one devin booker he's gonna go up in value too so if you guys want to make a little bit of MT, you could try sniping out these cards and try maneuvering the glitch. Um, let's see. Devin Booker is definitely going to be up there in value. So Devin Booker is around 3K. He was literally like 900 MT not too long ago. So he's up about 2K. He's at 3K, guys. So Devin Booker, definitely a card you want to pay attention to. Definitely. You definitely want to sell him um, when you get the chance. There's 14 hours left in the solos. I will do these later. So apply a new kicks player. Uh, true third offline and five assists with any thunder player so also thunder players might go up in value a little bit um so it's possible some thunder players might go up in value that's another thing uh, another thing is man these season tip off west slash east man they're gonna go up in value because guys they're not in packs they're not gonna be in packs for a very long time so as you guys can see my ben mclemore is up big time 3500 dante exum is up big time he's gonna be around 3500 as well so if you think about it, guys, if you want to pick up some of these cars and wait on them, they might be great investments. I think another one is Cat. Um, Cat, I picked up for around 20K. Colony Towns is up around 27K. So if you could try sniping one of those, I say he does rise to about 35 ish, 40K. And then he's going to drop down once those super packs come out or once season three does come out soon. So um, Colony Towns, definitely a player you want to look at. Same with Greg Oden, Darius Miles. Their price keeps rising and going up and then rising and then going down. But that's pretty much uh, how it's been going. Uh, Mike Dunleavy, another card you want to pay attention to. A lot of kids are still grinding XP, trying to get those done. They're a little late to the party. Um, so pretty much everything to do with XP is definitely going to be a great way to snipe. 
But uh, let's look at Dominique Wilkins because I did see like he was big time up in value and I want to check his price. So there's only two on the arch auction house right now. So let's compare them to mine. So mine has one less Hall of Fame badge. So what's the Hall of Fame badge that this card has? He has Showtime. No, Fast Break Finisher. He has Giant Slayer. So uh, he has Hall of Fame Giant Slayer on his. And with 40 minutes left, guys, he's going for 184K. I really want to sell my car, guys. There's three. There's literally three on the auction. I kind of want to sell this car, but then again, he's not going to be in packs for a very, very long time. Uh, it's up to you if you do want to sell your Dominique Wilkins. It's, mm, it's a good idea, but it's a bad idea at the same time. But to be honest, do you really think he could rise this much more from this value? I don't really think so. There's literally three up here. And honestly, I'm going to add a Hall of Fame badge and I'm going to sell him. There's no way. Honestly, I don't think there's any way he does go up any more than that. So you know what we're going to do? We are going to apply some badges, any badges that I could possibly apply. So uh, let's see. Any silver badges I could get to gold. He already has silver clamps. Um, let's see. Do, 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 do. All right, so I actually can't apply any badges to him. You know what? I'm going to probably sell them all, guys. It's a very risky idea, but you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm not going to lock into idle set anyways. There's nothing I can do with XP. So, guys, we're going to sell off our Dominique Wilkins. And honestly, if you guys want to make MT, if you guys see that the market is that dead with Dominique Wilkins, throw them up on the auction. I think I'm going to have the only Dominique Wilkins on the market in about three hours. So, what I'm doing, guys, it's up to you. I'm throwing up my Dominique, guys. Wish me luck. It's going up there for 100K. Hopefully, he sells. I might do the same with Manu. It's a good time to sell, guys. Dominique Wilkins, there's four cards up there. And also, we're going to go over some other investments. We're going to go over some Snipe Filter. So, Amethyst 20 still going crazy. Still going crazy. You guys most definitely should just check out the Snipe Filter. It's still going crazy to this day. Um, Amethyst 20 amethyst cheapest amethyst shooting guard they're all good filters let's see amethyst shooting guard see what's going on there because this does lock in cj mccollum um so amethyst shooting guard the cheapest one i think is reggie Guerin, which i also told you guys i think he's going to be worth the investment for around like 10k if you get a couple so yesterday in my video there was one for like 12 5 i didn't buy it he's like the 15k not the biggest profit margin but still about 1000 mt profit definitely guys try to try to snipe out anything to do oh that's a snipe oh yes sir so we just got a snipe real quick for steve smith he's going for a little bit more than that i believe like 18k so quick little snipe this 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 filter is actually pretty good shooting guard and at this because people do need to do that for the cj mccollum i think they're all set to be original oh no not totally sure so right there we just gone for 12k we're gonna sell them for 18 and right there yo kitchen just sold so right there in that video in that video i already in this video i already made about 10k mt like that it's just that simple so off this card off the Jokic's, right there man easy money easy mt so we're gonna sell him for 18k he's gonna sell for 16k we got him for 12 all right so we made about 4k mt profit after the reduction not bad at all plus the Jokic is about 3k plus i mean 2k plus per card so uh 4k plus 4 we made 8k in this video not even trying plus our dominique wilkins which we got for 120 this is exactly how you make mt you work little stuff guys you work little filters if you're making 20k mt per hour and you come on a game for in 10 days guys 200k it's that simple man it's very easy to make mt as long as you have at least 20,000 mt to work with um for you budget ballers this is definitely a good method like you would just have to work the auction. You kind of got to know pricing a little bit. I think that Dunleavy is a good value. And um, you pretty much just do exactly what I'm doing. Like I said, shooting guard out with this very good filter. Any filter pretty much that's cheap budget-wise, it's going to work out. Like I said, Jokic filter, uh, the Devin Booker filter. They all should be going off today. And honestly, that's all we got for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Have a good one. Peace. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure you hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.